Here is the English translation of your text. Many people, when they hear the word nuclear, immediately think of the atomic bomb. But it's important to distinguish between civil nuclear power, used to generate electricity, and military nuclear power, related to the construction of weapons. Both rely on the same physical principle, nuclear fission, but have vastly different purposes, materials, and technologies. Civilian nuclear power plants use low enriched uranium, which is sufficient to sustain the reaction needed to produce energy, but not suitable for making weapons. Nuclear bombs, on the other hand, require highly enriched uranium or plutonium in very specific quantities and purity levels, which are difficult to obtain without specialized and undetected facilities. However, there was a gray area. Some technologies, such as fast reactors or reprocessing plants, can potentially produce materials suitable for military use. This is why international treaties, like the Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty NPT, and regulatory bodies such as the International Atomic Energy Agency IAEA, closely monitor civilian nuclear facilities. In summary, while civilian nuclear power is intended for peaceful purposes, the risk of it being used for military ends, the so-called nuclear proliferation, is real. For this reason, transparency, oversight, and international cooperation are essential to ensure that nuclear energy remains a resource for development, not a threat.